Good afternoon, welcome to this video. We just arrived at the Wallamar Hotel in Poric, Croatia, visiting the Istria 300 cycling event and also the team presentation of the Israel Cycling Academy. Super cool, told you about this in my last video. We're going to be here for three days riding, meeting the team, I don't know, exploring the surroundings, and it starts today. Damn it! What a view, Mikey! Woo! Looks yeah. insane! Good place for breakfast tomorrow, I think. Yeah. Uh, we actually wanted to go for a bike ride today, but there's no time. So instead, we will check out the spa. And then tonight, we have a presentation about what we're gonna do and about the team a little bit. Apparently, there's an embargo on anything related to the team. So I think my first video will be about uh, the ride itself. And then on the 11th, I'm allowed to post uh, a video about the Israel Cycling Academy team. So I'll, I will probably be ready by then. I think we should get some lunch. Uh, yeah, lunch. Lunch at 4.30. <laughs> Perfect. two of our trip. Today we are going to test ride part of the Istria 300 race route. I hear a drone. Yeah, drone. Phantom 4. <laughs> You're drone spotters now. Okay, so yeah, next October there's a race 300, 250 or 100 and something kilometers. We are all here partly to look at the new Israel Cycling Academy team presentation and to check out this uh, race event. So today we will ride part of the route. We are going to stop at a really nice Istrian restaurant. There's one journalist ride that they asked us to join. And then there's the ride of the pros they that we are them. going to try to join. Because then we can talk to the guys a little bit on the bike. But also for the pros, this is the first time together. And yeah. also the first time on the new factor bikes. Uh -huh. First kilometers for the new season. Okay, I found my bike as well. Brand new Giant Content. Pretty heavy bike, but at least it has really fat wheels, really fat tires. Mikey's a bit worried that this bike is too uh, small. So these are all the journalists getting ready for the ride. Happy? Yeah, better. Much better. Do you want more? Uh, yeah, a little bit. That's uh, Julius, organizer of the event. Hey, Julius. Hey. Do you think you will get your yeah. Wahoo on there? No. I don't. I have a spaceship here now. An <laughs> hydraulic spaceship. It's, for, it's for weird looking. Yeah, but I think this is smart. We have yeah. a normal caliber, this is uh, Tiaga, and then you have the brake the stuff up there. in the middle. Crazy. Otherwise you have that uh, big, ugly yeah, brake. Yeah. Mike and I are both struggling a little bit <laughs> with our cockpit situation. And I think this has to be the <laughs> most ridiculous thing I've ever done. Wow mount is attached over the handlebar tape onto the handlebars. Because with this hydraulic system, there's no spot where you can put it. But it seems to sort of work. Even have my GoPro on here to film all the descents. Ready to roll. How's your situation working out, Mike? Not good. <laughs> no. Put it back together. Maybe do the same plan as you. Okay. Where are the custom ones from uh, Patrick? Are they from uh, Mo when you need them? Yeah, they only fit on these Alco, huh? Oh. What do you think I, the average speed I will be? I think the average speed will be 21 kilometers an hour for the ride to the restaurant yeah. and then the way back 35 because then the rest is going to go by car okay so maybe we are riding with the guys from the team they are arriving all in their 
still the team kit from this year, of course, but on the brand new Factor bikes. How do you like the new bike? I think they're really nice. Yeah, they look really cool. <laughs> the weight is really good yeah. for uh, aero bike. Climbing. But I think this bike, they say, with good wheels, like 7.2. Yeah, that's pretty good. Moving. Okay. More. Discussing the bikes. Yeah. Uh, New Spolit, last year riding on Scram. On scram. <laughs> he is now explaining uh, how Shim uh, Shimano works. Shimano works. <laughs> and he is covered on the Sella Italia saddles. <laughs> Watch you, your product. We're sending your product, my friend. <laughs> This is 4 degrees. What will it be in the summer? It's yeah. 34. The event is in October. Around that time it must be perfect here. Yeah. A little bit or how much is this? Yeah, I think uh, I think I can go more than 4 million. Yeah. Thank you. Can you put it on the To the back. Yeah. How much you want? Yeah, 5 million. Yeah. 5 million. Yeah, I don't have a bottle. <laughs> Just out of the team yeah. <laughs> already. We're fired. I think we have arrived at the location of the restaurant. So probably these guys are going to continue. I think we are going to uh, stop for lunch. This area is really, really beautiful. It reminds me a bit of uh, Tuscany. Same hills, same little towns. What are we doing here? Like that one over there. Ready for coffee, guys. Look at that. A little bit of alcohol. Yes. The berry, uh, I think. I think it's sweet. Not bad. <laughs> <laughs> you'll, you'll be quicker after. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Mikey, try it. Back on the road after a heavy lunch. It was heavy. Climbing again, but it was pretty good. And look at this view. We leave the team after lunch and uh, the rest of the day are going back with the car or maybe on a lower pace. And we are do 60 kilometers more. Yep. Going to explore some more. Hopefully see uh, some of the nice sights that are included in the Istria 300 uh, loop. So we're going down here now. Then up over that ridge over there, behind the uh, the village. And there on the south there is the sea already. Exactly. And then we follow the seaside to uh, Porridge again. Porridge. Porridge. Something that is definitely noteworthy is that the sun is really warm and that the roads are super quiet. I think we've seen maybe 10 cars 
and uh, yeah that's really really nice because the roads are really well surfaced and if you can just ride it without worrying about cars it's pretty uh, pretty damn good let's go Slam dunk, are you ready to make me? Ooh, we're on a pretty serious climb, lots of switchbacks, and it's getting really warm. I'm not losing. <laughs> Just taking pictures. Taking pictures of you. You want to say that I'm fat again? Yeah, I had, I had to wait for you. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, that's the only guy we saw in the whole climb. Yeah, true. <laughs> the first version <laughs> in a 20 minute climb. So I just risked the drone for a really nice uh, drone shot. Mike went, had to go downstairs to pick up the drone because it wouldn't land in the hotel room. But it looks like we got it back. <laughs> it's safe. <laughs> I think an emergency uh, uh, exit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because I wouldn't. There's no other reason to be on the. No, it is winter. The, the, terrace, the, right? <laughs> the swimming pool is closed. As I put a chair behind <laughs> the door. Between the door <laughs> and uh, run for it. Okay. Well, it's safe. Luckily, it's there. Now, let's go get some food. <laughs> Good plan. <laughs> 